Go ahead. Stormwatch coverage. Caroline. Uh, and Sine, you know, it's interesting. I don't know if it's the threat of, uh, of the forecast or if it was just the reminder of what we went through last year. But yes, from the hardware stores, the grocery stores today, a lot of people stocking up. Craig Randall doesn't even want to count how many gallons of milk he'll stock today. It's crazy. It's crazy. The milk will be wiped out. Probably by six, seven o'clock. By noon, the Safeway shopping carts were filling up. Shop for chicken, soda. Noodles and noodles, chicken. We have a roast, we have chicken. Feeding a family of seven, Eugene Terrell said he has to take the storm seriously. I got two cuts. For Ben Lightman, it's his wife and dog he's worried about. So these are for him. Even an inch of slush makes getting to the store difficult. So it's much easier to go out, prepare something for the last couple of days. Also have uh, 50 pound jugs. At True Value Hardware at 17th and R Street, it's shovels and salt flying off the shelves. Okay. It's the safe melt, uh, yeah, that which uh, easy, of doesn't course. ruin the concrete. So, so far, it's steady, but not nearly what it was last year. Last winter, we were unloading shovels off of the truck, bringing them in, and people were tearing the boxes apart. Back at Safeway, Boston native Ed McGovern can't help but make fun of us. His kids may be bundled, but his shopping cart is bare. The wine and chips in there. That's about it. Some <laughs> pizza, maybe, and call it a day. But as the day turns to night and the snow turns to ice, others say they would rather be well stocked than sorry. And near DuPont Circle here, we have a Safeway on one side of the street. On the other side, behind me, a True Value hardware store. Needless to say, very popular corner tonight. And since we arrived, since the snow started to fall, you can bet it has been a steady stream of people in and out. Reporting live from Northwest Washington, Caroline Leiters, ABC 7 News. All right, Caroline, looks like they're going to...